What's up, Peachlings? I'm Batman. Sorry for the Peachlings thing. Stupid Peach Lock Cove told me to tell you guys that again. And it's getting really annoying. I don't like it. And bye. Batman out. So yeah, what's up, Peachlings? It's Peach Lock Cove here. And today, um, I'm going to be doing a review on the Lego Batman movie, Bane Toxic Truck Attack. And uh, as you heard, Batman, yes, this is a Batman, Lego Batman movie set. So, the recommended ages is uh, 8 to 14, and the set number is uh, 70914. This is the Bane Toxic Truck Attack, and uh, it has 366 pieces. Retails for um, $64.99. And before I get into um, reviewing this set, I just want to thank you guys for 100 subscribers. I'm ready at 120. You guys are all awesome. And, uh... I'm gonna thank you guys. I'm gonna um, be making. I'm, I'm working on two stop motions actually, um, for uh, my hundred subscribers. Uh, my hundred subscriber, um, hundred subscribers special. And uh, so let's get on to reviewing. Let's start off with uh, minifigures first. First up, we got of course uh, the Lego. Um, first up, we got of course uh, Batman. And uh, I'm just gonna use a light here because it's really hard to get his detail for his mask. And um. Of course, he comes in every single set, but again, I still like the design of this Batman. I think it's cool. He has the nice uh, belt piece, and that's awesome. I think it's based on uh, like the Michael Keaton Batman, so always a fan of that, which is so cool. So iconic. He comes with two band batarangs, and he comes with an extra one, which is awesome. Three batarangs in the set you get. He got the Bat logo, and he gets, uh, of course, uh, the six-pack or the nine-pack, as he claims in the movie. No leg printing, no side printing, but it does have back printing, which is nice. And then that's what the belt looks like in the back. And let's show you what he looks like under the mask. Um, uh, it's the same uh, um, face print uh, from the Balloon Escape set. I'm kind of wish that I got a different face print, but that's okay. So he has the nice uh, new um, expression top on here um, with the black with the with the, um, his eyes there, so that's really funny. He has that grin, and the back here is, let's show you that, he has a, a surprise look. Next up, we got Mutant Leader. Um, and I'm not really familiar with this uh, um, character. I'm probably gonna have to Google him, but uh, he looks pretty cool. He has that nice uh, torso with uh, the six pack, and uh, I don't have this uh, um, uh, character, I mean, I don't have the torso yet, so that's cool. And he's actually exclusive for this set, which is awesome again. He does have a... Uh... Sorry, I don't mean Colossus, I mean Cyclops from X-Men. Um, yeah, so if you don't know what that character is, search him up uh, from X-Men. Yeah, so he kind of looks like that. So you could probably make a custom, which is awesome. But you, he does come in a set, so yeah, you can just get that set then instead. Next up, uh, probably the reason why you're buying this set is the Big Fig Bane. This is the first time we're getting a Big Fig Bane. And he looks so awesome. He reminds me of uh, the Dark Knight Bane. He looks so cool. I do like the design of this Bane. He wasn't in the movie that much, um, which sucks. But I love this big fig. It looks cool. He has like printing on his jacket, which is awesome too. I, I love this jacket. It looks pretty cool. He does have this nice uh, belt. And uh, he the, actually has this like nice uh, pieces that tries to show the Venom. I'm making him big. Which is, these are awesome pieces. Like, I think they only came on one other set, which is uh, the Mr. Freeze one in blue. The Mr. Freeze uh, Ice Attack, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. So these are cool pieces. Hope LEGO makes more of them. And it's old, It's bring, being held by this, like, uh, golden stud. And so, yeah, he does have uh, the nice muscles and, like, the huge gloves. And he looks pretty cool. He has green pants, a belt. So yeah, this, this is an awesome bean. Do love this build. Pretty cool build. Even uses that cell phone piece. So yeah. 
let's get on to the builds. So the first build is the smallest one out of it. It's uh, the bat helicopter. It's a little small bat helicopter. I'm really happy that they included a Batman vehicle instead of not just like uh, giving him no vehicle. So um, take Batman, just take out his batterings. He could go with his batterings, but I'm just gonna take him out. And you could just put him in, just put him in his sitting position. He has a, a seat there, just two studs holding him, but it actually works. There. So we're gonna make uh, this close, and I'm just gonna take it out of camera. There, and uh, I do like this. It looks pretty cool. It's actually a unique build, and I like it. It uh, here's just the bottom of it. I'm just gonna show you guys the bottom. But that wing just fell out. But um, there's two big wheels here and a small wheel, so that's pretty cool. This nice uh, um, whole bunch of nice pieces, like using these nice bat um, wing pieces. These wing pieces, so that's cool. A whole bunch of stuff. Oh, there's even storage to hold the battering. So yeah, I'm not. And it even has this nice uh, propeller and just spins, make him fly. So this build's cool. Has a uh, an awesome uh, scheme to it. Like it. So let's put that to the side. So this next build is like kind of like a factory build, like uh, for the Ace Chemicals place. So if you don't know what Ace Chemicals is, it's this uh, like uh, laboratory with like uh, lots of like uh, weird goop and stuff like that, like uh, toxic. And um, so Joker falls, and then after that's how he became the Joker. So that was just his like little backstory. But uh, it's cool that they actually included the sticker. It says Ace uh, Chemicals, and it's what I like about it is uh, it's like a Lego skeleton instead of a, um, a regular skeleton. So it has that on the other side too. And uh, has uh, that uh, piece uh, that's printed, not a sticker, um, just like uh, um, uh, that was used for the traps for the Ghostbuster line. And it's pretty cool, got these pin pieces. This is what the thing back looks like. Just get it through. So, um, the gimmick is you press this button. Wait, just hold it. Go, oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. Okay, there. And then that goes flying out. Um, it's supposed to be like an explosive gimmick. And it's this, like, uh, tank with a whole bunch of toxic in it. Green toxic. Looks pretty cool. You get three of them. Three builds for that. Nice, uh, translucent piece. Has that nice knob piece, too. So that's cool. I'm going to try it again. So you can just keep playing around with it and making it go crazy and making it explode. Maybe you can put Batman on there and explode it while he's on there. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Now let's get on to the final build of the set. And it's the main. So the final um, uh, build in the set is of course the main build, the truck um, that Bane drives. It's pretty cool. So before we get on to showing it what it does and stuff like that, like I'm just gonna show you this. So it has a gimmick that it can just roll like that. See, it has like these uh, like pin pieces, and it actually can do that, like rotate like that and go down. See, like that. So that's pretty cool. So it does use uh, two of those tires with this piece on there, and uh, this the two front tires are different than those tires. Show on that side too. So the front we have some lights, and uh, we have this uh, stud shooter, this mega stud shooter, this uh, six-sided um, stud shooter, and uh, it has these nice builds to it for the bullets. Instead of like not using the studs, they actually um, went a step further. And uh, fun fact, this is my first uh, six-studded um, um, stud shooter, and it even has that uh, magnifying glass. And yes, this is my first uh, magnifying glass piece. It's pretty cool. Of course, every truck has this piece. Well, most trucks in Lego. It's supposed to like, represent the um, engine. There's a whole bunch of stickers for like battle damage and stuff like that. So it's like a rusty uh, truck. And it has it on the other sides. There, that's a look. Two same stickers. And there's the on the sides here too. And it even has this other sticker, like Bane's logo. It's a bear with a, a B on top of his forehead. That's on both sides. You can move these. There. Has this huge uh, like Venom tank that can uh, come off like that. It's on pins. Pretty cool builds. 
has these two things too. Put that back, just to uh, line up the pins. It's pretty tight, I'm trying to get it in. There it's snapped in, and uh, here's what it looks like on overhead. So this is what it looks here. And uh, it does have those uh, fences for the SWAT police, whatever. It's cool that you get two of those. Get the flashlight so um, we can show it a little better. There's like a, a steering wheel, it's really hard to show. Over there, there's lots of room. The magnifying glass, which is a cool piece. Wait, there, see right there? And it shows all that stuff. Even uh, a window. Finally, you can uh, put mutant leader right there. Um, uh, and also you can put maybe um, sitting uh, near the um, steering wheel. And finally, yes, if you're wondering, you could put Bane on this uh, truck. So um, let's shoot the stud shooter. And it's cool. See? Oh my gosh, I'm not good at these. So that's cool. Does shoot crazy. You do get a whole bunch of uh, these studs. And a whole bunch of these pieces to make more bullet pieces like this. So that's cool. So you do get a crazy amount of these studs. Oh guys, uh, there's one more stud to shoot. There. That's it with all the studs. So that is everything you get in the set. Love everything in the set. Especially the Bane on um, Big Fig. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe and share the video. Um, I do appreciate it when you do. And it uh, helps out the channel. And if you want to see um, more of my recent video, I'm going to be putting uh, my LEGO Avengers Infinity War um, thoughts uh, video in the link in the description. So go check that out. And yes, the um, set pictures are out. So go check those out too. And uh, bye Peachlings. Peach Cove out.